And welcome back to Wolves Weekly, where we brought it downstairs from the Wolves Pro Shop. Because going on behind me, this is part of the Wolves Basketball Academy. These youngsters have been working for the last few months with the guidance of the Timberwolves and the Lynx staff to be able to come play a game on the main floor here at Target Center. It is a day that they will never forget and an experience through the academy that will last a lifetime. And guys, number three, Brandon White. And guy, number 14, Dominic Wade. So by far the coolest thing we do is the opportunity for the kids to play on the court here before the game. The kids get to sit right on the benches where the players do. Uh, we announce lineups, keep score on the big scoreboard. Uh, they got Gatorade there for them, the whole nine yards. So it's uh, it's an awesome experience that they get to be out here playing on the same court as, as the pros. Just playing on the floor, number one, is, is quite the thrill for the kids. But we're trying to say what else would be really fun for those kids and those families coaches to come down and experience throughout the game and so we're trying to make it as Timberwolves or Lynx like as we possibly can. We just started intros, lights out intros today with a spotlight on all the kids. We have a PA announcer, we do the intro music, uh, we have the Gatorade which is a big deal for the kids to drink so we're trying to make it really lifelike for play where the pros play. The boys get to come down here, they get to play on the big court, you know NBA, they watch it on TV, they get to see them, you know the NBA players here. They're pretty excited about that and I think a lot of the parents are very excited to come down here and see their boys on the big NBA court also. The game is not that important they just want to score score on the big court and play on the big court and that is kind of the main purpose why they're down here and the excitement they have for it. I know my son talks about it he gets all pumped up to play at the target center and to score a basket at the target center and to be in you know the game I think the game is probably less competitive than a lot of the other games we play in just because it's the whole atmosphere of I want to score, I want to shoot a three-pointer on the NBA three-point line. Yeah, so I'll give you an example. I was walking in uh, the tunnel here as the kids were walking in uh, here a couple weeks back as a couple of fourth graders, I believe it was, from Elk River. And so one of the kids says, this is the greatest day of my life. You know, and so you hear comments like that. And, he, and the kids get to go home and watch the Timberwolves play on TV or when they come to games say, you know, I shot a three-pointer in that spot or I made a layup in that spot or I drank the Gatorade that the Timberwolves or the Lynx players are, are, are drinking. The, the best thing that we hear is that that's their favorite memory growing up playing basketball. So even when they're 35, 40 years old, they still remember playing on the court, um, you know, where they made a shot from, you know, that sort of thing, rather than, you know, who won the game or what happened that year. They, they remember playing down here at the at Target Center. We've done it every year since fourth grade, so it's an annual event for us to come down. We've played uh, Corey's team the last, last year and then this year, so two years in a row. You know, getting kids just excited about the game in general, because we want to be there to help the high schools and the youth association just to grow their numbers and keep kids excited about the game. So anything that we can do to expose them to game, game of basketball and improve their skills or, you know, get them excited and keep them wanting more, that, that's our number one goal. We have a Basketball Academy website, Timberwolves Lynx Academy. If you can go to the Academy website, see our contact information. But we're probably out there with most of the communities anyway, and we're looking to expand upon that as we go.